Good morning. It is Monday 13th, I think, of December. Gosh, where is the week, months going? It'll be Christmas before we know it now. Um, yeah, so um, I've just got to go and get Jennifer and Paul up uh, to start to get them, get her ready for nursery and get him uh, ready for work. I've got work this morning. It's going to be a bit boring, so there's not a lot to report until after I finish work. So I'm fine, I'm a bit tired. Always a bit tired in the mornings, I don't like getting up. But yeah, I will see you after I finish work. Bye. Yeah, I finished work. Um, Jennifer's downstairs, I've just got changed. I'll go down in a minute. So I bought this scrapbook from Lidl's. It's got 40 sheets of black cardboard in it. Fixed cover, binding loops, it's really pretty. It's got a thing. And I'm going to keep a scrapbook for, for Jennifer next year. And it's going to be like... 2022, the year recording to Jennifer. So it's going to be things that she does in there. So pictures she draws at nursery, uh, photographs of her and Zed and us. Um, it's beautiful. And these are three ninety nine at the moment in Lidl's. They still got tons of them. But she's off. I might get a few more actually. What's wrong, baby? The cat's attacking her. I guarantee it. So a little bow there to undo. I'll just undo it and I'll show you. There it is. It is just really thick black cardboard. So I will write in metallic pens on this and I might start that tonight for her. It's really pretty. I still haven't found mine. I'm gonna have to have a look for it later. Beautiful girl, can you say hello? You see yourself? Is that Iron Man? It is Iron Man. She's got Iron Man. Watch out, oh, he's flying. He's flying, woo -hoo. You like Iron Man, don't you? A good girl. Okay, so it's Monday night, everybody's in bed. Um, it's not that late, I'm not sure what time, it's about nine o'clock, half nine? Twenty past nine. Oh, I've come up bed. I still cannot find this book. I do not know where it's gone. I had it here last night on the bed. You know I did because I was doing the, um, the what's it. I was updating it, I put another three books on the TBR list. And now I can't find it, it's, I can't find it at all. I'm actually trying to find it at the moment. I'm having a look round. I've moved. I know this room needs desperately sorting out and I will. Um, if I can't find it by the new year, I don't know what I'm going to do. Keep a record of everything I've read and all that good stuff on a notepad till I find it and then update it, I guess. But I'm going to have a look down the side of the bed. It's a side of the bed that very rarely gets tidied, so it could be down there. Um, I thought I heard something fall off the unit yesterday last night if i know i did but i can't see what it was that fell off and i can't see the book around there it's not behind it, it's not under it it's not either side of it i don't know um i've put everything away for now i want to do some coloring but it's not gonna happen tonight because i'm trying to find this book and i've put jennifer's scrapbook with it there's no way i'm gonna lose that it's too big but then it's me you never know i'd lose my head if it wasn't screwed on so i'm gonna have good could look and I, I just don't know where to look for it I've not put it on the side and stood it up and I mean I did say oh it looks really nice stood up but I haven't done that as far as I can see so but I'll have a look for it um and then I'm gonna hit the sack hopefully I'll find it I'll let you know in the morning it'll either be I still haven't found it or hooray I found it what is the point oh Tomorrow's going to be fun because uh, Paul is going out for his team meal. Christmas party. We're not having one. We're too big a team. Um, well, we're not too big a team, but we're a very big team. They decided not to have one. We had vouchers instead and I've spent mine. I'm thinking of getting an Instax printer for my phone um, rather than an Instax camera because then I can print photos off my phone to put in her scrapbook because I use my phone all the time for taking pictures. I think it'd be really cute. Um, you still have to buy the film, which is still fourteen ninety nine for 20 shots, but it's going to be mostly for the scrapbooks. Uh, her scrapbook and my journal, which is my diary, 
not proper journaling not journaling like what the americans do which i still don't understand and i'm still waiting to see i'm still trying to have a look for it so i do apologize if i'm not actually looking at you um but yeah anyway i will see you tomorrow and i'll let you know if i find it or not bye update i have found it it was down the side of the bed i'm actually going to put it on one of these shelves and um, probably that one there with my classics uh, they're not staying there, they're just there because I've moved them. Uh, that's part of my Hollywood bookcase. This whole bookcase is supposed to be just for Hollywood stuff. At the moment, I don't have enough Hollywood stuff to fill it, so... It's fine, so I haven't bothered sorting it out. It's one of the things I plan on hopefully doing in the week between Christmas and New Year. It's hard going. It really is some of this stuff is hard going, trying to get this stuff done before the end of the year. So I'm now going to curl up. I've left my Julie Andrews book downstairs. So I'm going to read a few pages of London Uncovered. I'm so glad I found it. Oh, it's such a pretty book and I'm really looking forward to doing this. Do you know what I mean? I mean, obviously I'm going to start on that page with whatever the next bit is. And I've got to find my key, my planner. And I've planned it all out. Um, and I'm going to get this one sorted out and then I'm going to sort out plan my book for the book of the film and do my old one um just get it written up it doesn't have to be full page spreads or anything and then i'm gonna get jennifer's done 2022 according to jennifer would be nice so i'm afraid to look back on when she's older if she wants to if not i'll look back on it it's just something to put things photographs of her as she grows up drawing she does at school because she brings home so many pictures and most of them just end up in the bin unless I, we really like them um there's a couple gone up in her room there's a couple on the door in the living room but that is really it now i am gonna actually relax because i found it i'll see you tomorrow bye everyone good morning it is tuesday 14th of december i'm gonna have to go and take something off his head and he's found a hairband from somewhere i don't know where he's got that from at the moment he's just uh, chasing it. You know what I said? Give it to mummy. I have put a box on the bed for him to get into if he wants to. He's winning it once, so hopefully he will. Just getting set up for work. Don't want to today. Not feeling it today. Just want to go to sleep. Anyway, yeah. I'm a bit warm. All the rushing around, so I've got my fan on. I just knew not to off the side, but there you go, push it on me. Oh, God, it's falling apart. Anyway, I'll sort out what he's doing. Don't know what he's got now. <laughs> I'll see you after work. Hey, so I finished work. And uh, my chair broke and I fell on the floor. I've hurt my back a little bit. It's not too bad, it's a bit achy. We went to uh, mum and dad had some lunch, took dad to the library, got mum some books. Um, as you know, I'm working on my TBR and I came back with two books. This one. And this chunker. And then dad says to me in the library, are you going to get some? I'm like, no, I've got over 170 books at home to read yet. I say in the new year, I might do. But uh, I want to try and get through some of them first and I've got a couple of books on the go, so. <sighs> oh, man. Anyway, we're all home safe, that's the main thing. Paul's out at his Christmas do. Said sitting in the corner looking, she's looking like you want something. And I'm going to work on my reading journal. I've been doing a bit and it's looking good. And I'm going to try and finish off the bit I'm doing. Here's Jennifer. Are you there? These are all Jennifer's pictures. She put them on the wall. I don't know what Daddy's going to say when he gets home. <laughs> Sell the tape on his walls. They're cute though, aren't they? Yeah, we're watching Peppa Pig. And a bit of colouring. Zed's eating Peppa Pig. Morning everybody, I didn't round up last night. I forgot all about it to be honest. I went to bed really early because I was tired. Um, watched a bit of TikTok. Didn't read very much yesterday, just read a bit of a, a Kindle book I'm reading. Um, I've got my glasses on because I'm having to sit on the bed while I wait for a new chair to arrive. I'll see if I can get one from work rather than one by myself, but, but we're going back in April so I might just get one anyway. Um, yeah, doing emails and... and it's going to be a very quiet day, coming straight home tonight. It was nice going to the library yesterday with mum and with my dad. It was really nice having a look around. We've got such a really nice library in Risk. 
Tesco. We're so lucky to have such a beautiful library, uh, which in part was funded by Tesco because they were told if they were if they were given permission to build the big superstore and the smaller one up in Rod up towards well, it's High Cross near enough. Um, they would get permission if they they do community stuff and they put money into community projects and that was the library so we had a beautiful new library built where the old Risca Palace cinema was um, which had been devastated by fire and closed down long long ago uh, so they kept the facade which is really nice beautiful uh, old cinema facade and just built a new library behind it and the library is oh, it's amazing bit of a palaver because we didn't know how to work the new machines our cards had expired so we had to get them all reinstated so my mum, my dad, mine and Jennifer's have been done. Paul's got to do his own. My mum, they've ordered a new one for my mum because it literally snapped in half. Uh, but I just, I mean, she could have used it anyway, but we could have used it. But we just put them all on my card. I've done with it and got mum nine books and dad three. So, because um, dad reads a lot slower than mum. But I'll go next week if necessary and get her some more. It bothers me not. I love going to the library. I didn't get any for myself. Dad kept saying, get some for yourself, and I'm like, no, I've got enough books. I've got 170 books or more. As you know, I added two more yesterday. I probably told you all this yesterday, I just can't remember. Coming straight home today, it's really dark, grim and horrible out. I like December, I like winter, but I like it when it actually is just cold and sunny and frosty. I love that, we haven't had none of that yet. I'm sure we will. Um, yeah so no changes in the way it's working with the omicron yet um we're all still working the same masks and everything nothing's changed here there's no restrictions yet they may well put some restrictions in i gotta be honest don't really bother me at all if they do what scotland did it'll be limited to three households meeting up which is fine we never i mean it's only me and paul and my mum and dad and his mum we don't really meet anybody else so anyway better crack on with the work and i'll speak to you later Ta Jennifer's just back from nursery and school and look at all the things she got from playing games today jumbo crayons sweets goldilocks and three bears and I just love this colouring book I want one <gasps> ladybird I am ladybird <gasps> octopus a balloon wow you're such a lucky girl aren't you Jen yeah are you a lucky girl oh, yeah. you your sweets yeah? yeah again. You like them? Yeah. Good girl. You are so lucky. And she did this colouring. She coloured some presents in. iHeartCraftyThings.com. We'll have to look on that website, won't we, to see what else we can get. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. Wow, that is amazing. Well done, I Jennifer. Yeah. Hey guys. So Jennifer's in bed and when I told my chair yesterday I must have bruised something because my back's hurting tonight. I got this today. It does come with a, a record. The record is downstairs and I'll be listening to that soon. But, um, it's mainly quotes and <clears throat> some weird artwork. Well there's some nice pictures as well. Like this. Basically, I don't know what it is. However, there is some of the quotes aren't actually real quotes of hers but the picture quality for the photographs when you actually find a real one is uh, is really good so that one's not hers there are certain ones that one's not one she said either but like I said the pictures that are real are good I don't think this is art myself, but uh, in a way they're taking away her face and her image with everything. It's beautiful, so I'm not too sure about that. But anyway, I haven't played the record yet. It is a 180 gram pink vinyl. My, I think is mine is, uh, there's a 1111 in total. I think mine's 450, so, um, yeah. I didn't even know it had been dispatched. I went into my emails, which I was trying to put down. Sorry, the cat's got the camera. Hang on a second. Got that, the cat grabbed the, the camera. I'm going to do some colouring in this one. Um, I've got two pages marked to do for a 
Colouropoly. Here is my reading journal. I've done a bit more in it today. So as you know, we've done the, the list, which isn't 100% finished yet, because who knows what I'm going to get for Christmas. <laughs> so I've done all this. This is my Goodreads challenge, which is 200. So the key is red will be physical, ebook will be blue, audio will be green, and if I get one from the library, it will be yellow. Over here, I've got my Stephen King challenge 12 and 22 and I've done the bookcases I like the idea of doing that but I just didn't fancy doing 200 of them um, and over here I've got my statistics page I haven't quite finished it yet I have got space on the edge if I wanted to do anything extra we've got the month down the left and we've got books bought red pages so that's how many pages per month and whether it's a physical an ebook or an audio book I'm gonna put whether it's a library book there because that would be physical as well so yeah it could have been owned rather than physical I might change it to owned and library you never know who knows um, but that's it yeah um, I did start setting up again I've got a book for next year as well so I showed you this beautiful these are gorgeous and it's upside down here we go it's 2022 the year according to Jennifer and I've used my metallic pens it looks greeny, bluey gold. It's actually all blue. That's gold and that's white. So I might go over the white again. Um, so it's blank at the moment, obviously, because we're not in 2022. But I might put some pictures of her on this side and me and her and Daddy. And we're going to fill that up next year together. I was talking about it to one of the girls at nurse. She said it was a really good idea. Something she can look at back, back on. If I got some spare money and they've still got some of these in, I might get a couple more because they might be nice for future years. Who knows? Anyway, I'll see you in a bit. I'm going to just crack on. Morning. It is Thursday. Hooray. We're getting there. Right, Jennifer's gone to nursery good as gold this morning. Um, just setting up to work again. Still waiting for a chair. Hopefully the office is going to send me one. Some facilities. I'm not feeling too good. Feeling a bit down today. I was last night, but I'm all right. It's just... Oh, don't know. Anyway, I'm fine. I'm just going to plod on, get the day done, and then get Jennifer and try and tidy up a bit and have some fun with her this afternoon, do some jigsaws or something. Might be something we can do, have a shower later. Nice. Maybe a bath, I don't know, I haven't decided yet. We'll see. Anyhow, I'll see you after I finish the shift. <sighs> Let's do it. You nicking Grandad's tinsel? Yeah, I got some more. Yeah, all of his tinsel. There's his tree. We will get some more lights for it tomorrow if we can. I can't do it. Looks better than ours, but there's no cat on yours, Mum. <laughs> Bring it here then. I'll put it in a bag for you. All right. All right. So this is going to be a short uh, weekly vlog because uh, I haven't been reading very much this much. I'm still reading this book, but I haven't read much of it for a while. So I'm going to try. And uh, read a bit of that tonight. I've got uh, my back still aching from where I wrenched it yesterday, or the day before yesterday. So, oh, I don't know. Tomorrow, after we've been shopping, I'm going to take Dad down to what? Because he needs some lights for his tree. Because the bottom ones there's uh, some missing and they, the ones in they weren't working so we need to replace them so that's fine I haven't done any more work in my reading journal for next year yet I will probably do a bit more tomorrow evening and over the weekend I am so tired I do apologize um yeah I like the way it looks I might show it on TikTok even though I don't do book talk I've got a camera talk, which I'm going to just expand to doing everything else other than just uh, cameras. And then we've got Marilyn talk, which of course is only Marilyn and will continue to be so for now. So yeah, I'm just going to check, check out, take my medications, hit the hay. I'll try to read a bit more of this book because I would like to finish it. Uh, so it's another one off of my TBR and into my red list. We're on 209. Where's it? 210 because I finished one of those. I think it's 210 books for this year. 
like I said, a lot of them are very short, cosy mysteries from the Kindle. So next year it's going to be more, hopefully, physical books. That's why I've got a physical thing on here where I'm going to track whether I'm reading physicals, TBRs, or, uh, physical ebooks, or listening to audiobooks. There's also a square foot if they're library books, which will be physical. But it's just to see if I get anything from the library. Stephen King ones in Stephen King Challenge will all be uh, physicals. So they'll all be red. Just simply because uh, I keep them. And they have a shelf of their own downstairs, which I will have to show later. There's so many books I want to read on this list. Not including the ones I bought the other day that I haven't put on the list yet. Because who knows, I might, you know, we've still got a couple of weeks left. So, yeah, I haven't put them on yet. There's still a few over from at Mum's, I think. And there's one, two, three there. And two, there's five. I do have some photography books as well, but I'm not going to put them on because that's not the sort I'm going to read. I'm more likely to just dip into them and have a look at them. I gotta go, I'm so tired. I'll see you tomorrow, I'll take you to what if I remember. And hopefully I'll have read a bit more of Julianne. Good morning. It's Friday, hooray, last day of the working week. So I'm just setting my laptop up. I read a good chunk of this last night. I'm on page 241 of 316 so another 70 pages probably finish that tonight with any luck so yay I'm, I'm, I've really enjoyed it I'm um, just getting ready to start work plenty of time though Zed's just jumped on me hello Zed <laughs> you fell asleep on my legs last night he's the strangest cat because he wags his tail like a dog now I know that when cats swish their tails they're supposed to be in a don't touch me don't come near me leave me alone mode you know so they're likely to scratch bite jump on you and or hiss no not him he wags his tail because he wants affection he's like a dog i swear he's a dog reincarnated like misty or cement i don't know but i've never had a cat so i don't know but he does wag his tail like a dog so anyway i better get ready um like i said we're going to walk later so hopefully we might find some nice goodies it's getting a bit close to christmas so they won't have much left which is great because it gets annoying after a while but there's always the arts and crafts and scrapbooking stuff i want to look at for my um reading journal so yeah so on my andrea the camera girl uh tiktok i might change the name to andrea the hobbies gal uh, just simply because I'm, i just don't want to do just camera stuff on there and i don't want to put other stuff on my Marilyn TikTok that is purely for Marilyn so I'm gonna start putting book stuff on there and journaling while I'm scrapbooking and doing Jennifer's and stuff like that um, as well as photography there still will be photography especially next year when the weather gets better <sighs> anyway I'm gonna get going get ready for work and I'll see you afterwards back now I've got to take the camera to what so we have been bought a few bits some cards and stuff I'll show you in a minute Jennifer got a dinosaur. I'll show you that in a minute. Oh. Jennifer, what do you want? She's not happy because I won't give her stickers. I've got some stickers. Some of them are for my flipping journal, but she'll probably nick them. She's not having my Victorian ladies in their Victorian dresses, though. No. Okay, you had Christmas and trees. Mine. And trees. No, no, some of them are mine. mine? That one's yours. That one's yours. And that one's yours, but I want some as well. And these ones are mine. I got some little craft embellishments here. Some butterflies. And the Victorian ladies. Let me see. Uh, Where's your dinosaur gone? Uh, Here your dinosaur, Jen. Did Greta buy you that? Yeah. Is it multicoloured? Look at it. It's a pride dinosaur. It's a rainbow. It is. It's a rainbow. It's a it is cute. He's lovely, isn't he? Now, watch this. Can you get it under his chin? Let go, Minnie. Let go. Oh, it's cute. <laughs> <laughs> it's clever, isn't it? Well done. Oh, no, we better go before he eats us. Oh, so it's bedtime. Um, 
I'm boiling. Uh, everybody's in bed. I've just come up, said downstairs. I've got about 40 pages of this to go, so I'm going to try and finish it tonight. I've really enjoyed reading it. Fascinating story. She don't, she don't pull no punches where there's problems she, in her life, her marriage, her relationship. She certainly tells us. Amazing woman. Amazing, amazing style. Love Julie Andrews. Love Victor Victoria. I remember seeing that when I was a kid and adoring it. You know, she plays a woman who plays a man who plays a woman. Because she can't get a role and a job. So she dresses up as a man and tries to get a job. I guess a job as a drag queen, so she has to pretend to be a man, pretending to be a woman. It's really cool. I, I must get that on DVD and watch it again. It's one of my favourites. <laughs> I haven't seen it for yonks, but I love it. Anyway, I'm going to head off and read this one, and then tomorrow I'm going to really try and make a dent in the horrible bumshell. Because I want to get it finished before the end of the year. I want a nice start to the new year of any decent Marilyn rereads coming up. Uh, for Marilyn Talk, I started posting videos, book videos on my TikTok which I've renamed Andrea Life 123 if you want to find me. It's just, I just, I'm just not going to post enough photography content so I thought let's do about whatever I, I get up to. So the cat, Jennifer, books, photography, places we go, people we see and just have fun. So yeah, let's, uh, let's spread the love and I'm going to advertise some of my local places on it like the prints and just stuff like that. Anyway, I'm gonna go read this book and I will tell you what uh, what I rate it in, in the morning. I finished it. I'll see you then. I know. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's Saturday. Jennifer's playing with Peppa Pig and a striped multicolored dinosaur. They, she put some tinsel on the tree yesterday, as you can see its branches are drooping from where Zedicus, Catechus, has been jumping on the tree and there's no star at the top. Been bad because we're doing a big Christmas clean this weekend, getting it ready. So we just got to keep on top of it. Oh, you can see the things we found behind the sofa. Off you come, including my, where is it? Two of my pens that I've misplaced, including, oh, Jen, that's yours. That goes with that. That was it. My black sparkly one I lost ages ago from the Scribblicious. Last time we had the sofa out, it didn't turn up, but now it has. So I'm going to have some lunch and crack on with some more. What are you doing with Daddy? What have you put in his pocket? What's in there? It's a poop. It's not a poop. Uh, but you better not put a poop in his pocket. Poor daddy. Poor daddy, it's for sure. I bet it's a spider. Is it a spider? No, it's not a spider. It feels like. Whoa, well, it is! Look! <laughs> we are still tidying up. There's all Jennifer's stuff on the wall. That's the wrong way around. <laughs> Oh, it's a hard day today. I'm about to sort of wash it out and put it away. And we've just put up a pin board in Jennifer's room for her to put stuff on. And that was a blab, I can tell you. We've tied up the living room and the dining room. It's all ready. Just need to keep it clean and tidy. And we've actually put the pin board up for Jen. I'll show you that when I take a close in. It looks really good. Just because she gets so many things and she wants to pin them up on the walls. And there's tape everywhere. And we don't want tape on the walls. Because it looks awful. So we've got a pin board and it, God, it was a nightmare because these walls are like literally rock solid. Rock solid. So it's very hard to actually get anything into the walls, but uh, Paul's done it. we all done it. Put a couple of things on. She's got some more pins left and we'll get some more push pins tomorrow. We'll get the multicoloured ones and um, put some stuff up on the walls for her and, and it'd be cute. So I'm going to sort of wash that and then I'll show you the pin board a bit later. So here we go, here's a pin board. We've just got a, a reindeer thing with some drinks and an owl she did at nursery. Um, we've got plenty of space to put other things, so some pins up there, but not many. We'll get some more tomorrow and start putting stuff on it. She loves it. Hey, Zed, come down, please. You're not allowed there. Come on. Hey, it's Saturday night. 
living room looks so much bigger because we've moved stuff around a bit put stuff away tidied up hoovered some nice space for jennifer to play in we want to try and keep it like that it's hard we both work hard and stuff we were so tired we had pizza tonight which was nice and uh, from capanios and then when jennifer went to bed we wrapped up all her christmas presents decided what we were keeping back for her birthday in January because her birthday is the end of January I actually don't get paid till her actual birthday because I get paid on the last working day of the month which is her birthday so and it's a Monday this year long weekend um what else wrapped up my mum's presents just got to do my dad's and Paul's now he's just got to do mine <sighs> been a busy day so I am going to dry my hair and read a book I might do a handheld TikTok. I hate doing handheld TikToks because they're shaky, but I need to find... Every time I buy a tripod, it just breaks. So I've got... I have got 50 quid that Paul's dad's given us for Christmas, so I'm going to have a look at... <sighs> ones that hang on the desk. I prefer a proper tripod, but it just doesn't seem to work. My tripod's too big. Um, when I put it on there, it's... I need to fiddle with it. It'd be alright for face to face, but that's about it. Or well, straight on, but I need I need one that I can angle downwards, so I'm gonna get one of those in the new year. So for now it's just my hand holding. I mean I can hand hold this camera pretty steady, but my phone one, no, 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 no. Anyway, I'm gonna dry my hair now. Because the cat's not up here yet. He doesn't like the hair dryer. Put the clean washing away. Yeah. Be more to do tomorrow i'm sure <laughs> there always is now we do it again tomorrow sunday and then it's back to work on monday but it is christmas week yay i'm kind of excited i'm really i am looking forward to christmas i'm not gonna lie i'm really looking forward to it um so seeing jennifer's face is gonna be lovely christmas morning all right i'm gonna go i'll see you later bye okay guys it's sunday morning i'm gonna get dressed we're gonna go and do our weekly shop we've got to pop to tesco's get some Christmas and birthday cards and a few uh, bits and pieces and this will be our last other than getting some stuff next week sh shop before Christmas there'll, there'll be one food shop briefly but everything presents is all finished today <coughs> wraps them up and stuff got some stuff out of the attic ready for um for Jennifer she's got two Christmassy snow globes you might have seen them before Put Father Christmas up on her board, um, and a Santa light and set of bells for putting them in the window. So I gotta find the batteries, which are around somewhere, and uh, make sure we got enough for all of her toys and games of Christmas. I think that'll be an Amazon order. I'll have to check my uh, battery box, see how many I got, because one of her games takes eight batteries. <sighs> I trust Paul to get one like that. Never mind, it could be worse. Uh, yeah. So I've been watching a bit of TikTok this morning, which is fun. Um, I'm going to get dressed and I'll see you in a bit. Here we are. Nanny and Granddad's Christmas tree is all lit up with the lights we got the other day from... What? what? Isn't they? Why? What? Yeah? What? What? <laughs> I won't put you on camera, Mum, because I know you don't like being on thing. Apart from your wedding photograph. That can be on. Oh, that's different. <laughs> it's up there. So yeah, we've done our shopping. Jennifer was very cute this morning asking for permission to get her toys out because it's all tidy in the living room. I was like, you don't need permission, just get them out, it's fine. I take it you're talking to this camera. Yeah, some vlogging. Yeah. yeah. A very nice little Christmas tree. Bye. Jennifer's just had her bath and she's all wrapped up getting her hair dry so she can go to bed and the cat's here and she's not happy. She says she needs to leave her alone because she's going to bed soon, ain't you? <coughs> See? And here he is, look. She really does like him. But uh, he does uh, annoy you. Okay, guys, I've just started reading this book. Which I've had hanging around for a couple of years. Oh, and in between watching Finders Be Busy Three Seekers. So I'm going to call it a night. I hope you enjoyed this weekly vlog and I will do it all again next week. And of course it's Christmas week so it's going to be a fun one. I'll see you soon.